Hey, Dr. Abud, thanks for showing, thanks for being on the show. Thank you very much. Yeah. I'm uh, privileged to be on. Things have changed a lot in the last 20 some years you've been in business. And I think, I don't even know if how active internet when you actually got into this business. But from your experience, what, what you observed uh, in terms of how technology and internet, how has that effect, uh, affected the way you do business today? Well, it did revolutionize the business. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, it changed the way we do business, it changed the way we market our business, it changed the way, it changed the way we reach out to our new customers or to current customers. Mm -hmm. So the digital age has revolutionized dentistry completely. I think we are way ahead of dentistry in medicine in the way we socialize mm -hmm. and interact with our patients through the digital age. Mm -hmm. uh, it made it easy, mm -hmm. yet it made it very difficult to adapt to the new changes. Uh, the digital age has probably the most effect on the way we do business. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, in addition to the new equipment and the new technology that helped us improve the quality of work, mm -hmm. the communication that what has changed completely and have changed the way we, we do business. Mm -hmm. And then how has the, 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 the advent of internet and social media and things like that helped you acquire new customers? Uh, well, it took a while, mm -hmm. but we were probably one of the front runners of adapting to this new internet and social media and we jumped on the wagon early. Mm -hmm. uh, so we have a tremendous presence in the social media and online. Uh, it helped us because we know the, um, the quality of services we can deliver. Mm -hmm. So it helped us to spread the word about the quality we do. It does hurt others who cannot adapt and unable to deliver the services we can mm -hmm. so it, it made it very easy to uncover the uh, bad work mm -hmm. basically it's it's the uh, spreading the bad reputation like what we say if you don't take care of your reputation mm -hmm. it will take care of you <laughs> and with the internet it makes it really, really fast. When you do something wrong, everybody hears about it really quickly. Exactly, and if the social proof is out there on, on the public world, it, you know, people talk about it fairly fast. I mean, most people don't talk about good service they get, but they do talk a lot about the bad service they get. Absolutely. I mean, you have 100 cu happy customers will never post mm -hmm. a, a, a good review, but you have one angry customer will make sure that they would post a bad review. So need to try to avoid that one angry customer and try to go above and beyond to make everybody experience a happy experience. Mm -hmm. Dentistry is very unique. When you come to the dentist, you're unhappy to see him for many reasons. <laughs> number one, you expect pain. Mm -hmm. Number two, you expect it's going to cost a lot of money. And number three, you're going to expect the bad noise and the unhappy feeling when you sit in that confined room. So you need to make sure that that visit is clean, mm -hmm. easy, comfortable, and at least deliver it with a smile. Mm -hmm. it, it does taste a lot better. Most certainly. So have you, you know, you've been at it for quite some time, like we said, 22 years. What are some big wins that you've, uh, you've had in, this, this, um, in, in the building of this business? Big wins. It's, every day is a challenge. Mm -hmm. You know, it doesn't matter what you have done yesterday, it's what you do every day. Mm -hmm. Just because you were a successful dentist yesterday, and you need to continue doing a job you do or do a better job at it. Mm -hmm. It's, it, you are not for, it, it, you'll never be forgiven if you do a great job yesterday and you do a bad job today. That's true. So the challenge is continuously delivering top treatment, top service, and every day is a new day. What you have done yesterday does not count as what you do every day going on. Mm -hmm. Is there one, one mistake that might come to mind in the last 22 years that you made that... Oh, I'm not saying anything. <laughs> not saying anything. Mm -hmm. uh, success always come after failure. And it does feel a lot better when you succeed after you fail. Mm -hmm. There's many cases you make a bad choice, as long as it doesn't cost you your reputation and your well-being of your patient, you're okay. Mm -hmm. We all make mistakes, we all adapt to new 
a scenario, a new technology, and then you find out that it doesn't really work. And you, all what you do is correct it. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the nature of the beast. Uh, you can't succeed every day. Mm -hmm. You're going to have to fail. If you don't fail, you'll never appreciate the taste of success. Where do you think, where do you think the industry is headed from a, from a medical space and how is technology and online marketing and social media might take us? The very noticeable thing in dentistry is the emerging of, emergent of a large companies. Mm -hmm. So that will influx a lot more money into the social media space and in the internet marketing. Mm -hmm. uh, because these larger companies come with a, large, a lot bigger budget, a lot more money, and there will be a lot of influx into advertisement. If you see today, uh, you, we are not used to see two or three TV ads an hour uh, on a prime TV for dentists. Now mm -hmm. you see it very often. Mm -hmm. Maybe not now because it's an election period, but the minute the election period uh, end, you will see dentists have a lot more space. And that shows more money being mm -hmm. spent into that space. So it's certainly going to change. And it's the more these large company come in with billions of dollars, they're going to spend a lot more money in advertising mm -hmm. than smaller company. So uh, for us, we, we are sizable in our city mm -hmm. and we are probably one of the only large company that we are local. Mm -hmm. uh, we started in the city of Chicago. We are only in the market of the city of Chicago. We did not go anywhere. Uh, you need to take care of your home base. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're doing. It's uh, providing good service and continuously deliver a uh, the feel of mom and That's mm -hmm. how we do business. If you had to do it all over again, what would be one, one or two things that you would change? Life doesn't come with a rewind button. I never <laughs> think about it that way. It's uh, Today is another day, tomorrow is a new day. Whatever mistake you made yesterday or today, you just need to correct it and move on. And no regret in life. Just awesome. uh, keep pushing and tomorrow is a better day. Awesome. Well, I appreciate you taking the time to be Thank here. Thank you, sir. Yeah. I appreciate it.